grab a grande size cold cup, pour strawberry puree to the bottom indent, and then pour heavy cream to the bottom line. And then mix it up, pour that into the blender, add two pumps of toffee nut, and then two pumps of classic, and then two pumps of, two pumps, two scoops of dry strawberries, a grande scoop of ice, three pumps of cream base, and blend that on one. Pour that into the cup, add whipped cream, and this is the Captain Crunch Frappuccino. Enjoy! Here's how you order. Start with your berry hibiscus, pour it to the first line, add your water to the next line, scoop in your berries, add your ice, pour it in the blender, pour it in your cup, and now add with cream. Strawberry puree, soy milk, pour it into the blender, a splash of passion tea, one scoop of berries, four scoops of vanilla bean powder, ice, cream base, Stick it in the blender and blend. I'm gonna double blend. Pour it into the cup. Add whipped cream. Put a lid. And there you have a Periwinkle Secret Menu Frappuccino. Enjoy. Salt, Salt and caramel, caramel cookie, cookie frappuccino. frappuccino. Start with your cup. Pour whole milk to the bottom black line. Pour it in the blender. Add dark caramel sauce. And java chips. Couple shakes of salt. Ice. Add your base. And your lid. caramel drizzle in the cup and some more salt and pour with cream caramel drizzle salt through your lid and there's your salted caramel cookie frappuccino all right so this is for everyone that's asking what base does so these are the only two blenders we have we're gonna do cream base in this one and no base in that one and we're gonna make a mocha frappuccino so i'm gonna pour whole milk to the bottom black line pour it in the blender add mocha to both of them ice and ice so this one gets base and that one gets no base and blend see this one versus that one this one pours smooth. This one is chunky. Ooh. But add your whipped cream. Put on your lids. And there you have a mocha frappuccino and a chunky mocha frappuccino. Today we're gonna make the red drink. Let go. Okay, we're gonna start with passion tea. And then strawberry acai. And then coconut milk, one pump of raspberry, one pump of vanilla, and berries. Add some ice and shake. Pour into the cup, add a lid, and there you have a secret menu red drink. Enjoy. Grab two granite size hot cups and two Earl Grey tea bags. 
put the tea bags in the cup and the tea bags in between the two cups. Add four pumps of vanilla syrup. Oh, all right, don't know what that was, but add four pumps of vanilla syrup. So you're gonna add whatever kind of milk you want and pour it to the tall line. I just use whole milk because it's creamier than 2%, so yeah. And then you're gonna steam that. And you're gonna pour hot water halfway on the cup and then fill the other half with the steamed milk. And this is the London Fog Tea Latte. Whole milk to the bottom. Apple juice to the bottom black line. Pour it in your blender. One scoop of matcha powder. Two pumps of dark caramel. One scoop of ice. Add cream base. And blend. Add caramel drizzle to the inside of the cup. Pour it in the cup. Add whipped cream. More caramel drizzle. In your lid. Caramel apple frappuccino. Grab a grande size cold cup and the cold foam blender. Pour 2% to the 150 milliliter line. Add two pumps of toffee nut and three scoops of cloud powder. And then blend that on four. Then you're gonna pour the cold foam to the top line and add ice to the bottom indent. And then you're gonna add two espresso shots. So I think my favorite thing about this drink is how the shots go to the bottom. I think it's just really pretty. So you're gonna add caramel drizzle and then a ring of mocha around the edge. And this is the ice cocoa cloud macchiato. Whole milk to the bottom black line. Pour it in your blender. Also, all of our other blenders are broken, so that's why we're using this one. Add your raspberry. Scoop your vanilla bean. Add a scoop of strawberries. Scoop of ice. And your cream base. And flat. And pour. Add your whipped cream. And your lid. And there's your cotton candy frappuccino. Grab a grande sized cold cup and a shaker. And you're gonna wanna pour coconut milk to the water juice line. Then add four pumps of pineapple ginger syrup. And then three scoops of the golden ginger blend. Add ice to the grande line. Put the lid on and shake it. And then you're gonna pour that into the grande cup. And this is the iced golden ginger drink. Grab a grande sized cold cup, add caramel drizzle to the inside of the cup, add six pumps of vanilla, and four pumps of cinnamon dulce. Then pour 2% milk to the top line, add ice to the bottom indent, add two shots of espresso, and then add more caramel drizzle on top. And then I kind of swirl mine around to mix it up a little bit. And this is the caramel snickerdoodle macchiato. And here is the recipe for it, enjoy! Grab a grande size cold cup and a shaker. And then you're gonna wanna pour coconut milk to the water juice line. And then pump four pumps of the pineapple ginger syrup. And then three scoops of matcha.
And then add a grande scoop of ice to the top line without spilling it everywhere. And then put the lid on and shake it. And then you're gonna pour that into the grande cup. And this is the iced pineapple matcha drink. Enjoy! Add your strawberry puree. Pull milk to the bottom black line. Pour it in your blender. Add your java chip. Add your ice. Add cream base. And blend. Pour strawberry puree in the cup. Add mocha drizzle. And pour it. Add whipped cream. More mocha drizzle. More strawberry. Add your lid. Chocolate covered strawberry frappuccino. Here's how you order. Today I'm gonna make a frappuccino for all you chocolate lovers. Lego. Whole milk. Then we're gonna pour it into the blender. Then we're gonna add mocha. Java chips. Cookie crumble. And dark chocolate curls. Then I'm gonna add cream base. Ice, and then blend. I'm gonna add a little cookie crumble at the bottom. Then pour it into the cup. Add whipped cream. Some more cookie crumble. A lid. There you have a secret menu chocolate explosion frappuccino. Enjoy. Okay, we're calling this one the zebra frappuccino. Start with whatever size cup. We're gonna do heavy cream to the first black line. Pour it in your blender. Add mocha and white mocha. Big scoop of ice. Cream base. Add your lid and blend. White mocha, your lid, and there's your zebra frappuccino. Grab a grande sized hot cup, add two pumps of hazelnut, two to three pumps of vanilla, three pumps of white chocolate mocha, and two packets of sugar in the raw. Then you're gonna wanna pour whole milk in the steamer to the grande line. And then you're going to steam it. And then when that's steamed, you're going to pour it and leave about an inch from the top. And mix everything together because there might be stuff on the bottom. And then add whipped cream. Oh. Try not to get it over the edge, but you get the point. And this is the warm sugar cookie drink. And a lot of you guys ask me how you make it, so this is it. Pause it or screenshot it. You're welcome. Butterscotch Frappuccino. Start with your coffee. Whole milk to the bottom black line. Pour it in your blender. Add your butterscotch. Add your, Add your coffee base. Add your whipped cream, add your topping, and your lid, and there's your butterscotch frappuccino. Alright everybody, I think it's time that we make the Nutella frappuccino. It's time to make a drink.
I also got a new cup today, so I want to try it. Alrighty, so we're looking at a mocha frappuccino with hazelnut, caramel drizzle, and caramel crunch topping. What? Oh my god. Alright, it looks good, but how does it taste? Just like the holy crap. What? Today, we're gonna make a secret menu sunrise frappuccino. Strawberry puree, coconut milk, peach juice, and then pour it in the blender. Three scoops of the golden ginger powder, vanilla bean, ice, and cream base. And I'm gonna add a little bit more puree. Should come out orange. Pour it into the cup. Dang. Add whipped cream. A little more puree. Dang. Add a lid. And there you have a sunrise frappuccino. Enjoy. Vanilla, Vanilla bean frappuccino. frappuccino. Start with your cup. Whole milk to the bottom black line. Into the blender. Vanilla bean powder. Ice, cream base, and blend. Pour it in your cup. Add your whipped cream. And your lid. There's your vanilla bean frappuccino. Grab a grande size cold cup. Pour heavy cream to the bottom line. Pour that in the blender. Add three scoops of vanilla bean powder. And one and a half pumps of hazelnut. Add a grande scoop of ice. Three pumps of cream base. And blend that on one. Then pour it into the cup. It's kind of stiff because of the heavy cream, but you know, oh, okay, don't make a mess. Add whipped cream and some sprinkles. And this is the birthday cake frappuccino. It actually really tastes like a birthday cake, so enjoy. Grab a venti size cold cup, pour whole milk to the bottom line, and then pour that in the blender. Then add four scoops of vanilla bean powder, two pumps of mocha, and two to three pumps of raspberry. And then add four scoops of java chips. Add a venti scoop of ice. Add four pumps of cream base. Blend it. While that's blending, you're gonna add caramel drizzle to the cup. Pour it in the cup. Add whipped cream. And more drizzle. This is my version of the Ariana Grande Frappuccino. Ice caramel cloud macchiato. Start with your cup. Pour milk to the 150 line. Add your cloud powder. Pump your vanilla. Pour it in the cup. Add some ice. Pull two shots of espresso. Pour them in the cup. Add your caramel drizzle. Add your lid. And there's your iced caramel claw macchiato. So after coming up with ideas in my head of a Valentine's Day drink, even though it's kind of late, I came up with this. It's so good. So grab a grande size cold cup, 
pour heavy cream to the bottom line. Pour that into the blender. Add three pumps of mocha. Two scoops of dried strawberries. A grande scoop of ice. Three pumps of cream base. And blend that on one. While that's blending, you're gonna pour a little bit of strawberry puree into the bottom of the cup and then pour the frappuccino. Try not to spill it. Add more puree to the top. Add whipped cream. And a chocolate spiral. I call it the chocolate strawberry frappuccino. Bubblegum frappuccino! Start by making a strawberries and cream frappuccino. Put the strawberry puree to the bottom lid. Whole milk to the first black line. Pour it in your blender. Two pumps of raspberries. Big scoop of ice. Add your cream base. Add more puree and pour. And there's your bubblegum frappuccino. Okay, not gonna lie, today was a stressful day at Starbucks, but luckily frappuccinos make my heart sing. So we're gonna make a frappuccino real quick and we're gonna do it in the style of Sailor Moon. It's time to make a drink. Okay, so I'm thinking cookie cream crumble with white mocha instead of regular mocha. And then we're gonna add strawberry puree at the bottom of the cup. Let's do it. Let's also add a scoop of blackberries. It looks so good. The drawing got destroyed though the second I poured it in, but uh, we'll deal with that to trouble it. All right, it looks, well, kind of cursed, but how does it taste? Exactly how I expected it, amazing. Okay, so you're gonna grab two venti hot cups, two jade citrus mint, and two peach tranquility tea bags. Then you're gonna put the tea bags in the cup and put the tea bags in between the two cups. And then ask your barista to add one to two bags of honey. We don't have any, so I'm using this. And then add one to two pumps of peppermint. And then you're gonna fill the cup halfway with hot water. And then add lemonade to the tall line on a steamer. And then you're gonna steam the lemonade. And then after the lemonade is steamed, you're gonna wanna pour it into the cup to fill it up. And this is the medicine ball drink. Strawberry puree to the bottom line. Whole milk to the first line. Pour it in the blender. Add one pump of classic. Scoop of ice. Cream base. And blend it. Split it into two cups. Set aside to the first line, pour it in the blender, two pumps of white mocha, two scoops of java chips, scoop of ice, cream base, blend it, split it into the other cup, add whipped cream, add the toppings, and now you have a strawberry cookies and cream frappuccino. Pina colada frappuccino. Start with your cup. Coconut milk to the bottom black line. Pour it in your blender. I did all. Four pumps of pineapple syrup. Ice. Add cream base. And blend. And there's your pina colada frappuccino.